Dr. Lorraine Sharp is in Peace River for a residency. It's her second day. One of her preceptors is Dr. Catherine Wood. A preceptor is an experienced healthcare practitioner who serves as a clinical role model and a resource for learners. Catherine has been practicing here for just over three years. Before that, she did a residency here herself. Back in her second year of medicine at the University of Alberta, Catherine came to Peace River to do a one-month rotation. It was such a positive experience that it planted a seed for her future. I immediately just said, wow, this is, I'm getting so much more hands-on experience. Um, I'm like really enjoying my time in the rural community. She returned again in third year for a nine-month rotation in what is called the Integrated Community Clerkship Program, or ICC. So did her husband, Dr. Adam Mildenberger. We loved every second of it. It was, it was great. Everybody is very interested and engaged in teaching. We felt like we became part of the community. We had patients that we followed that we felt responsible for. We had preceptors who came to trust us because they'd known us for nine months. From our experience, even this clerkship, we were invited to rec basketball teams. My wife uh, did a book club. People had us over for dinner during holidays. Are you sure this isn't arugula that's just oh, gone from seed? Dr. Mildenberger was originally from Beaver Lodge. Dr. Wood grew up in Edmonton. But their positive clerkship experience in Peace River convinced them that this is where they wanted to practice and start a family. I have great job satisfaction um, and we have a really strong community of young physicians in Peace River um, who form a large part of our social network. Looking back, they recognize the value of preceptors in recruiting new physicians like themselves to a community. Today, they lead the ICC program in Peace River. We've all benefited from somebody taking time to teach us. And I think particularly those of us who feel lucky enough to have had very good and very passionate preceptors, we very much want to pay it forward, right? We want to make sure that ongoing medical students keep having that same experience. Because we were drawn to Peace River from teaching opportunities, we hope one day we will recruit new physicians through it as well. So it is a little self-serving where hopefully we can recruit more physicians to help out um, in the future. Dr. Mildenberger is a GP anesthetist. This morning, he is getting his equipment ready for a day in the operating room. He currently has residency students. They're not here this morning though because they are given the independence to see patients on their own. Well, here we try to get our medical students to book their own clinic, follow up their own patients with us supervising, and so they kind of start to build up that ability to practice uh, more independently. Sometimes you'll also find Dr. Wood in the OR because she has enhanced surgical skills. Not today though, because she is doing a shift in emergency. She also practices obstetrics and has already delivered about 400 babies. Both Catherine and Adam cherish the rewards they receive from being preceptors. They keep you fresh. You're constantly kind of double checking that something that you're telling them is still up to date. I think they often have interesting perspectives. It's great having them with us in practice. It's a very rewarding part of my, my career. They're always very grateful for the time that you spend with them. They strongly encourage med students to consider doing a rural placement. The rewards are many. Even if you eventually want to go on to specialize, if you want a good foundation, I think Wool gives you that ability where you're just assessing patients that are broadly differentiated and developing kind of what I say the fundamental skills, which is like taking a good f uh, history and doing a good physical exam. You are way more likely to <laughs> come out of here with excellent suturing skills, excellent delivery skills, excellent surgical assist skills than you are in the city.